Scanning a role can be a perfect way to get important information about the role, which is helpful for activities like quality control, analysis of wear out, or simply producing a drawing from an existing role. Data M has more than 10 years of experience in the design and the application of role scanners. The use of high quality within optical and mechanical components helps customers to get accurate measurement results. But how does a role scanner operate? The measurement device. The optical system of the roll scanner measures the silhouette of a roll with a backlight system. That means, on one side we have the light source and on the other side the camera. The machine has four axes. One of these axes is dedicated to the autofocus function of the roll scanner. We have more than 10 years of experience in the design and the application of roll scanners. We only use high quality optical and mechanical components. Preparation of the scanning In order to prepare the scanning process, we should clean the roll to make it free from any burrs and dirt on the scanning surface. Then we mount the roll properly on the plug and fix it with a fast-fixing attachment. Description of the scanning process First, we need to enter the roll data and select the correct plug in the menu Options, Roll Data or Function Key F5. The function key F6 or the menu Options Start Scan will start the scanning process. The system now scans automatically the roll contour step by step and updates for each step the current camera image in the camera view. No user input is needed for this process. Only the correct plug geometry must be provided in order to define the correct start and end diameter of the measurement. The operator should observe the camera window while the roll is being scanned. If any dirt is visible during the scanning, the process should be interrupted, the roll cleaned and the scanning restarted before the cleaned area. Within the blue rectangular region of interest, ROI, the contour is tracked. It is dynamic as the software is automatically adapting the width of the ROI according to the optimum focus of the current contour section. Only one side of the silhouette will be entirely measured. When the contour measurement is finished, the maximum height and the maximum diameter of the roll will be measured on the opposite side in order to center correctly the roll. Finally, the digitized points together with a vectorized contour will be automatically shown in the roll window. Moreover, a DXF file will be automatically generated for a further use of the measurement results in a CAD system.